Hello, welcome to the SAP HANA development for SAP Business One eLearning. My name is Thiago Mendes and today we are going to talk about SAP user experience development tools focusing on the SAP UI5 library. So here is the agenda. We are going to first learn the user experience trends in the market and understand how SAP is addressing them. Then we will take a look at what is SAP UI5 and its features as well as how to implement the model view controller concepts. Finally, we will create a front-end app based on the SAP UI5 library. The way people work with software has dramatically changed over the last number of years. Today, people use mobile devices as part of everyday life. They are used to experience soft speed and simplicity they get from Facebook, Google, Apple and Amazon. These experiences raise the bar for business software as end users demand the same experience from SAP solutions. As a result, user experience has become relevant to enterprise applications in a new way. It isn't that user experience wasn't important before. User acceptance has always been a vital part of system selection and release. But it was generally focused on a single type of transactional user. It takes on its new challenge because enterprise applications are directly relevant to executives and of greater strategic importance to the enterprise. So, while these new expectations set a higher bar for user experience, they also become mechanisms to enhance the business value of applications. Differentiation through digital experience can expand execution power and profitability of the enterprise. Innovations in computing hardware, smartphones, tablets, surface displays, 3D displays, etc. have been among the biggest game changers in the last years, blowing a hole not only in the traditional desktop computing model but integrally changing the nature of human interaction with computer systems and our concept of what computing is and can be. Smart mobile devices offer opportunities for business beyond accessing information and interacting with data on the go. Augmented reality, location sensitivity and other smart devices capabilities offer untold opportunities to solve business problems and increase user productivity. Interactive surfaces like tablets, walls and windows have the potential to transform the way people collaborate with one another and interact with software. These innovations have and will continue to have a profound impact on the way we design applications and consequently the way people live and work. So, you must be asking yourself now, how SAP is fulfilling those trends in terms of user experience? Let's then take a look at the SAP UI5. SAP UI5 is a UI technology that provides everything you need to build enterprise-ready web apps. It comes with all main SAP platforms, but can also be used outside the SAP ecosystem because a large part of SAP UI5 had been open-sourced with the Open UI5. HTML5 is a collection of technology that includes the fifth revision of the HTML markup language for content and structure, CSS3 for look and feel, and a series of JavaScript APIs for behavior. It is developed through cooperation between the W3C and the Web Hypertext Application Technology Working Group. SAP UI5 is independent of any SAP backend release and can run on top of existing SAP systems. It is available on the major SAP delivered platforms and is therefore available not only for SAP products built on these platforms, but also for customer projects. SAP UI5 is an industrial strand solution making it the first choice when building enterprise applications. It goes beyond adherence to the web standards by complying with all SAP product standards including security, globalization, accessibility, software lifecycle management and performance. It allows you to deliver non-disruptive enhancements efficiently across multiple platforms such as for SAP HANA Access and SAP Cloud Platform. The concept of Model View Controller MVC, is used in SAP UI5 to separate the representation of information from the user interaction. This separation facilitates development 
and the maintenance of those parts independently. Model, View and Controller are assigned the following roles. The View is responsible for defining and rendering the UI and can be defined using XML, HTML, JavaScript and JSON. The controller reacts to view events and user interaction by modifying the view and model. Finally, the model manages the application data binding. The purpose of data binding in the UI is to separate the definition of the user interface, which is in the view, the data visualized by the application, which is in the model, and the code for the business logic for processing the data, which is in the controller. The separation has the following advantages. It provides better readability, maintainability and extensibility. It also allows you to change the view without touching the underlying business logic and to define several views of the same data. Views and controllers often form a one-to-one -one relationship, but it's also possible to have controllers without any UI. These controllers are called application controllers. It is also possible to create views without controllers. From a technical position, a view is SAP UI5 control and can have or inherit an SAP UI5 model. View and controller represent reusable units and distributed development is highly supported.